The 63rd Annual Antiquarian Book Fair is happening this weekend at the Park Avenue Armory. It's a real mecca for bibliophiles. First editions, manuscripts, maps and atlases, illustrated books, you name it. It's a bit hard to navigate the show, especially that it's my first time here. It looks like a maze. There are almost 200 exhibitors here, and it's packed with visitors. But I see some familiar names, like Pingel Rare Books from Paris. I spoke with Alexander during Tefaf Maastricht in March. Also, I see here a Peter Harrington booth with a great collection of literary works. Another booth I was impressed with in Maastricht was Shapira Rare Books. I saw a copy of The Tempest, illustrated by Marc Chagall. And here I get to talk to the founder of the company. I'm Bernard Shapiro from Shapiro Rare Books. Uh, the business started in 1979 in London from a small antique market. And from there it's grown into a big business with a lovely, beautiful shop in New Bond Street in central London. And we're here today at the New York Book Fair. And we've got a few highlights on our stand. We can start with this beautiful book by John Gould on the Birds of Asia with 500 hand-coloured pictures of all the birds of Asia, all hand-coloured in 1880, in wonderful condition, in seven volumes. Over here, we have a wonderful book by Nicolas Jacquin, which is on the flowers of America. Jacquin was sent by the Emperor of Austria to go to America in the 1760s and draw all the plants he saw in the Americas. They had all the illustrations of watercolours and there were 15 copies made of 240 in each copy, which took over two to three years to do. An incredible work of art. Another great interesting thing here is a letter by Tolkien, an autograph sonnetta with his usual handwriting, which was very exciting to see his handwriting, very precise and very neat. And little notes he made on the letter, and then here at the end, signed by him. Something quite special. Another fine collection we have here is a collection of watercolors made in China for the export market. This is a collection which has 300 watercolours in three volumes. Flowers, birds, all done to show the crafts and art of China in the beginning of the 19th century. So this is almost 300 years old. Those are some of the highlights we have at the show and I hope you enjoy them. So if you're interested in rare books, this is the place to visit.